Hey guys, those looking for babies. I do have babies on eBay. Just wanted to um, remind you guys about those. I have a Frankenstein. I have a baby witch, which are Halloween babies. And I don't typically really ever make fantasy dolls that often. So these are ones you won't want to miss out on. My mom does have a zombie baby on here as well. Definitely should check that out. And then I have one, two, three regular reborns on here as well i'll make sure to put all the links in the description below but yeah so here's babies on ebay if you're looking for babies <laughs> hey guys so different view here we're gonna change penny she's just here resting on her tummy this is on top of my shelving unit for the babies um I put a changing pad up here, which I think is nice because it's like perfect height for me to stand and change the babies. So I thought that I would make a changing video here, but I'm going to have to move you guys a little closer so you can see Miss Penny better. There we go. Look at that little cutie. So I found uh, this outfit that I have. It says beautiful with a ghost on there. I need to put this on her because you know what's going to happen is Halloween's going to come and go and I have not used any Halloween outfits. That's how it usually works out for me. It's like, oh, lovely. I had that, but I didn't use it. <clears throat> so, yeah. Let's look at this little cutie. She is so cute. Super cute. Oh, no wait, we're gonna be, I got her socks, so we're gonna be doing like a complete outfit change. So you guys will get to see her full cloth body. Um, for those of you who aren't familiar with like the cuddle body babies, she's all cloth, look at those little cloth legs. Oh, you got some cute cloth legs, girl. Your diaper, look at that, her diaper is sagging right off her butt. Okay, what is going on there? Pull that up, girl. You got a saggy diaper. All right. I don't know what's going on here. I don't know if it's the diaper or the baby. Might be the baby. <laughs> okay, so let's... You have a button. Your hair is going to get messed up. You have some buttons. So, um, guys, I've been putting together some ideas for my Patreon. Um... And if you guys aren't subscribers to my Patreon, you should definitely go check it out because everyone is loving how we have like our private own little group there. <laughs> and it really is our private own little group. It's really cool. And um, right now I do have a kit special going on. So I have a painted kit special, which is only available to my Patreon members. But that's not what I want to talk about. What I want to talk about is... Lately, I've been getting a lot of requests to do um, painting classes. Like, people are like, I will fly to you in California. Will you do painting classes? And such and such. So, I was like, you know what? Yeah, I will do that. And um, I've been kind of thinking about, like, what I can do so nobody has to fly. Which I think, nobody has to fly. Nobody has to pay for a hotel stay. So I think in the long run, it would be a lot cheaper for everyone. Um, what I can do is on my Patreon, I can make a tier where you pay for the painting class, the painting lesson. And what I'll do is I will have a video already set up from start to finish on how to paint a, re a reborn baby. And so that way you're able to follow it and you're able to pause it as you need. And you're able to go back and check it out as you need. So what I was thinking is that um, I would get a kit that everyone can get, you know, like the Quinlan by Laura Lee Eagles. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> like a real born kit. And I would paint it from start to finish. And then those of you who are wanting a private lesson, that's basically like a private lesson. So you would go, you would purchase that Patreon tier and I would have all the supplies that you'll need to get. And then, um, You'll be able to just watch that video as you need. So you guys can let me know what you think about that. 
in the comments below. And for those of you who are like, what is Patreon? Just check out the link. It's, you know, it's pretty awesome. So that's something I've been trying to figure out. How can I give private lessons without, you know, and I'm not all over the world because I'm just here in California. Like, how can I share what I do with other people? So I'm thinking that, uh, base, you know, making that thing on Patreon because that'll be basically going to be a private class and then if you have any questions of what takes place in the tutorial then you can message me and I can answer because I'm pretty quick at responding there because we don't have a lot of people and um so I'm able to have you know more one-on-one -on -one conversations with a lot with everybody actually so that's just an idea that I've been having like how can I teach um where everyone can benefit from it, not just those who are in California. That's not to say I might not have a California class, but right now it's probably going to be all through the internet. Um, that way everybody's schedules works out and no one's having to travel and wait, you know, spend that kind of money. So it'll definitely be a lot more affordable just to do, um, like an online session. So yes, those have been my thoughts. Oh my gosh, look at this girl. She is looking so cute and her hair is, well, it's not that bad messed up, but <clears throat> it is a little, oh, it's a little messed up. It was so pretty and then I changed you. There we go, well, we're fixing it right up. See that? I can just style her hand, her hand. <laughs> I can just style her hair with my hand. I love how just the mobility of the cuddle buddy, uh, bleh, ah, oh my goodness. The mobility of the cuddle body is so awesome. Like, I know a lot of people are like, I would never have one, but it's really cool and they're really cuddly, which is nice. I need to get her a different pacifier because this is so much pink, but I need to find one that she can actually, because she can take a, I need to make her modified pacifier so we don't have to use magnets. She just has a whole lot of pink going on here. But the, I, so if you guys can get your hands on a cuddle baby, they're awesome. And Jackie's going to have one for sale here very soon. But I think the cuddle body are just so much fun. And then we're going into winter, so it's like perfect timing. And as you guys see, she looks very realistic, like... You really don't even know that she's missing her limbs. <laughs> You're missing your limbs, Penny. Where have your limbs gone? I don't know where they've gone, Mommy. I'm not sure. All right, you know what? We're gonna do another giveaway entry for that reborn baby because I want everybody to have as many entries as possible. And if you are a member of Patreon, you'll have that many more m entries. Like you get a lot of entries on top of the entries you can earn extra if you're a member on Patreon. So let's go ahead and um, go to the original giveaway video and comment what color makes you think of fall. Me, it's like a burnt orange. Totally think of fall when I see burnt orange. I know it's random and I'm trying to keep things very fall and very Halloween-like. So fall, everybody goes through the seasons of fall for the most part, so I figure. You guys can go to the original giveaway video, which that link will have already popped up. And um, you can comment what color makes you think of fall. And I believe that's going to give you guys a total of four entries so far. And if you're on Patreon, some of you already have 50-something entries. I know you're going, what? 50-something entries? Yes, if you go to Patreon and you become a member, you have a chance of getting 5, 10... 25 50 extra entries it's crazy so yes please comment what color makes you think of fall because i believe the giveaway babies ended on the 20th so i'm doing my best to give you guys many chances to get lots of entries to that so yeah all right guys well as always thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe like this video and share it with your friends watching don't forget to subscribe to in love with reborns 2011 you know click that notification button turn on the bell don't ever miss a video like this video share it with your friends
Did you do it? Hello?